Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Star Lord. I hope that you're having a fantastic day and in today's video We're actually gonna be looking at the brand new assault rifle weapon in Fortnite Battle Royale Which is called the G36C. I believe that's what it's called. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section below uh, But yeah, this is a brand new assault rifle that is going to be in Fortnite Battle Royale sometime in the near future. It's it's actually pretty scary to think that there are gonna be new assault rifles coming to this game because of course when a new assault rifle comes or when new weapons come, old weapons have to go into the vault for quite some time and that's pretty sad, you know? But you know, it's all for a good cause. They need to test out different weapons and all that kind of stuff and even new weapon mechanics such as, you know, the G36C is actually a toggled weapon. You know, you can fire it in uh, auto fire or you can actually have it in semi-auto. So you never know, that might actually be a factor with this new weapon in Fortnite Battle Royale. You could actually put it to Full auto or semi auto, which would be really, really cool. Uh, but anyway, before we actually get into today's video, guys, please do not forget to leave a like. If you do end up enjoying this and find it helpful, let's see if we can smash 1,000 likes. That would be insane. And also, if you want, subscribe to the channel for more Fortnite glitches, guides, videos, all that kind of stuff, just like this video. Okay, so anyway, getting into talking about these weapons. First off, I'm actually going to use the shotguns as an example here. Um, but yeah, basically, three new shotguns are now currently in. Fortnite Battle Royale. This is, you know, the pump shotgun, we've got the tactical shotgun, and now we've got the heavy shotgun, also known as the Spaz-12. Uh, so there are three different types of shotguns in this game, and there is still two more shotguns waiting to be added to the game. If you don't actually know what those two shotguns are, they are on screen right now. And as you can see, one of them is a shotgun that is fully automatic. It goes crazy, like boom, 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 boom. And it also has a drum barrel, which is going to be insane. So yes, its fire rate will be quicker than the tactical shotgun. And also, we do have this weird looking one that I really don't know too much about. All I can assume is that it's a very slow firing weapon and maybe its, it's power is very, very... Like, like, strong? I'm not too sure. We don't know much about that one, but the previous one that I just showed, yes, that one is actually going to be a fully, fully automatic shotgun, which is absolutely crazy. So, there's going to be a lot of shotguns in this game, and also, it has been rumored, or, you know, it's actually out of the bag right now, that there are a couple of assault rifles that are currently getting tested in... Epic Games as private servers and everything like that and just a couple of these weapons I'm gonna throw one on screen right now. This one is the M4A1 with the scoped assault rifle So it's an, a, sco a scoped M4A1 which is again Very crazy the fact that we're gonna have two scoped assault rifles in the game, which is kind of cool uh, But yeah, this is actually modeled after the M4A1 itself, which is you know that that's pretty cool now, if we do look at the other one, we've got a P90, which is coming to the game. I'm not too sure if this is going to be classed as a submachine gun. Technically, it is, but I've seen that some games in the past have actually put it as an assault rifle, which is kind of crazy. So, you know, I would assume that this is going to take over one of the, like, TAC machine guns or something like that, or the MP5 or something, you know? Um, but then also, we've got this brand new weapon. This is on screen right now, and as you can see, it is the one from the thumbnail. It is the G36C. This weapon is a precision assault weapon. That is actually how it shows in the in the actual in-game files and this will mark the th the third is it the third or the fourth no it's actually going to mark the fourth assault rifle that has been added to Fortnite Battle Royale, which is kind of a bit scary, you know, because, I mean, I, I, it's going to be the SCAR, it's going to be the M16, and it's also going to be the full burst, or the, you know, the uh, the semi-burst, and uh, this weapon, and personally for me, I think that they're going to g actually scrap one of those previous weapons. Now, first off, this weapon could fully be fully automatic, just like the SCAR, because if you think about it, the SCAR is, like, one of the only real, real fully automatic weapons out of the assault rifle bunch, you know, the, the M16 is more of a precision shot kind of like tap, 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 tap sometimes, you know, whereas the SCAR, most commonly when you shoot it, is pretty much fully auto, you hold down a trigger and you're constantly shooting to kill somebody because it's very, very good, it's, it's precision, you know, that weapon is a very precise weapon, it's got like the smallest aim. Now again, like I said, this weapon in the actual in-game files is called a Precision Assault, and that's pretty scary, you know, because yeah, the SCAR is actually considered a Precision Assault Rifle, and it's one of the only ones that has a fully automatic kind of thing to it too, I don't, I don't really know, but I cannot see them getting rid of the M16 personally for me, I, I don't think that's going anytime soon, and maybe it might just kind of replace 
the, the, you know, the, the, the burst assault rifle, it might do because this weapon has two firing types, you know, it's, it's got the full automatic or the burst, you know, so it's really hard to say, but there has been like a little rumor here and there that, yeah, it most likely will be replacing the actual scar itself. I don't know how viable these leaks are or anything like that, but apparently some people on the Reddit, uh, I, I, it'll be on screen if I can find it or something like that, but one person says that he has connections close to Epic, he actually revealed, like, why he, like, he revealed a little bit of information about how he has this information and everything like that, and, uh, yeah, I don't know, it's, he's starting to say that they're gonna be replacing the Scar sometime soon with this weapon here, so, you know, that could very may well actually happen, I'm not too sure, hopefully it doesn't, I love the Scar, I really love it, but, if you think about it, four assault rifles in the game, it's a little bit crazy, you know, it's it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit crazy right there, like, four assault rifles in the actual game itself, I'm not too sure if that's gonna be a thing or not, like, my, me personally would think that too many game, too many weapons in the actual game itself would just be oversaturated, you know, like, if you're always hoping to get, like, a scar, for example, and you keep on coming across, like, a P90, um, a Spaz-12 shotgun, you know, you come across the full automatic shotgun, you come across the M60, like, there's just gonna be so many weapons in the game that it's gonna be impossible to find the weapons that you are comfortable with, I mean, at least now, at the current stage in Fortnite Battle Royale, when you get into a game, you kind of have a gist of what weapons you're gonna find and which ones you're gonna pick up and replace for the current ones that you've got in your inventory, you know? Like, for me, for example, like, if I find a hunt rifle in a game, I'm gonna swap out any weapon for that hunt rifle, I tell you. But, like, if I get, like, if it's, let's say, for example, they give you the option of having a SCAR, a G36 weapon, an M16, a TAC shotgun, a full automatic shotgun, a pump shotgun, it's just gonna be like, wow, what, what weapon do I even change here? Like, what am I meant to be changing? It's, it's, it's absolutely crazy, you know? So I would actually love to know your guys' opinions in the comment section below. You know, keep them nice, but if you think that they're gonna replace a weapon, which one do you think it's going to be? A lot of rumor has been saying that it's gonna be the Scar, but, you know, it could very well be, you know, the Burst Assault Rifle, because it does shoot in two different types of uh, kind of shots and everything like that. Not only that, but in the next couple of weeks and everything, as we find out more information about the P90, I believe the P90 is going to be the next weapon that is going to be added into the game. So, you know, as soon as I find out any more information about the P90, I will most likely upload video and kind of fill you guys in a little bit. All, all the, right, right now, just from right now, I do know that there are three rarity types of the P90, of which I don't know exactly what they are, but I would assume that one's going to be like, maybe a uncommon, a rare, and maybe even a epic variant. That's personally what I'm thinking, but you know, I could be a little bit wrong there, but I do know that there is guaranteed for a fact, right now, three rarity types of this weapon in the actual in-game files. Uh, so yeah guys, if you want to see more videos like this where I kind of talk about upcoming weapons and leaks and everything like that, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and uh, yeah, definitely turn on notifications for more videos like this. And uh, yeah guys, anyway, so what I'm actually going to do really quickly is, the other day I had a little bit of a mobile iOS giveaway on the channel, and uh, I'm actually going to pick a winner right now, so that I can pick him out, and then I'm also going to be reading out what you guys have to do to win today's code for the actual thing itself. So I believe it was this one right here, and um, yeah, if I just kind of do this little thing right here, right, let's see, okay, right, okay, I need to actually run like the third party thing, and um, let's see, come on, load up for me, will you just load up for me a little bit, you know, it's, yeah, sorry about this guys, okay, Okay, so I've actually just done it, and the winner of the actual Fortnite mobile iOS code was Dong Yen Lee. Uh, please remember to check your YouTube inboxes, dude, as you have won the Fortnite mobile iOS code. Uh, check on that, and uh, for those of you who are waiting for a code right now, uh, yeah, all you have to do is right now in the comment section below, just put into the comment section, um, let's see, let's see. Pina Colada, just put Pina Colada, I don't know if you guys can spell that, like I know some of you guys are going to be like a bit of a younger audience, uh, but yeah, just type in Pina Colada in the comment section below, and uh, in the next video, I will actually go and find uh, one person, one very lucky person who wins a Fortnite mobile iOS code. I am running out of these codes, by the way, guys, so there won't be many more of these going around, but uh, you know, still, yeah. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to leave a like, and also subscribe to the channel for more Fortnite glitches, guides, videos, all that kind of stuff, and have an awesome day.
Until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya!